On the controller side, you get your controller box. I only have the three axis, not the four axis controller, which plugs into the machine. Then there's a plug for the emergency stop. This one is for the two length sensor, which is optional, but for any CNC router, you really should get one. Then a plug for the fourth axis, if you have the right controller, and one for another digital output. On the other side, there's just a plug for power and the on-off switch. The USB cable from the controller box just plugs into the computer and you're ready to go. The software you control the machine with is aiding CNC and it's pretty easy to use. But instead of more talking on that, I would say we start up the machine and start cutting something.